Well, probably the Nixon scandal came out, and it was Nixon's terrible income tax fraud. Uh, Nixon got a $500,000 exemption for his White House papers uh, that probably were worth a third of that. Uh, he paid taxes for two years at the rate of a maybe a janitor at the time. And that was something that people could understand very well. At the same time, all the other charges against them were coming uh, to be understood more fully by the country. And because of this, because of Nixon's continued offenses and the power of public opinion, Congress changed so that it became more risky for politicians to keep Nixon in office than to vote for his impeachment. How about deep throat for First of all, I want to get into the importance of Deep Throat and the relative importance of Deep Throat. <coughs> but for the benefit of our audience, explain who Deep Throat was and from your perspective. There was a source named Deep Throat. And I don't think Woodward <coughs> Bernstein ever imagined it would get to be as big as it got. Um, but this mystery became a Washington parlor game, and for the next 30 odd years, you know, the question always was well, who was this? mysterious secret source. And Earl was one of the suspects for a while. I mean, Thank you for pointing that out. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate that. Uh, finally, in 2005, felt uh, his family sort of pushed him forward to come out and admit that he was deep throat. And Woodward uh, reluctantly confirmed it. Whichever way it is, there's a myth out there. If you ask people about Watergate, they say, oh, yeah, the president was top aide who involved in it. And how was it cracked? It was cracked through deep throat. I mean, that's the common thinking, the common myths nowadays. And I think hearing from Barry and hearing from Max, I think, is very valuable and educational uh, to you folks for understanding that, uh, that that is not the way the investigation went down. And no matter what, whether you believe what, what Max's emphasis or Barry's, that it was not the, the, the deep throat that was responsible for the uncovering of the Merit conspiracy to obstruct justice that came through as a result of the secret meetings we had with John Dean and uh, Jeff Magruder and then others following.